red wine braised beef short ribs. Yeah. So a little low over the simmer. So we brown them in canola oil, which is quite healthy. It has a very high um, um, cooking temperature, so you can get them nice and brown. And then did it in two batches, so we don't have too much fat in the pan at once. And then we chopped up a little mirepoix, the carrots, celery, and onion. And we browned the onions a little bit. Added some flour and tomato paste. Listen to that goodness. I wish you could smell it. Flour and tomato paste until it gets all thick and dark red. And then we add the red wine. $3.99 bottle. It's for cooking. All that alcohol that so many people love. It's going to all be burned off right there. See? Say goodbye to the alcohol. It's going away. Burning off. Yeah, and then uh, once this simmers for another 15 minutes or so, we're going to add all these yummy herbs. Uh, not the garlic bulb with the skin on it, um, but we do have whole garlic here. We have flat leaf Thai and parsley. We have some thyme, T-H-Y-M-E, and some rosemary, and some fresh oregano and bay leaves. Yeah. Imagine all that flavor. It's going to go in there with some beef stock. So, and then we'll put it in the oven and we'll be eating it like, you know, midnight. Um, all that goodness. I wish you could smell this. All right, so that's where we're at. And this was a new dish for me, so I didn't want to videotape everything in my frustrations if I had any. But we're cooking along and it smells really good cooking with ease.